is good, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to another video. Let's get some basics out of the way before we start this video. Now, I will be going over my updated shoe collection, obviously, but I'll also be doing a lot of fashion tips. This is gonna include some do's and don'ts for wearing shoes with stuff. Also, big disclaimer, if you clicked on this video thinking I was gonna have like a giant row of Air Jordans, I don't do that anymore. And that's kind of part of my whole fashion tip thing here. I ended up actually selling a lot of um, my old Jordans. So I know you guys are gonna be sad. And I did mention this before, but I sold my Space Jams. I sold my UNC 12s. I sold my CP3 12s. Let's hop straight into the shoes part of this, right? We're gonna start with the basics. These are the shoes everyone should have. A pair of black shoes and a pair of white shoes. I will see people with the coolest shoe collection. They'll have every color in the book other than basic white and basic black and I have no idea how they make outfits. On the screen right now, actually I'm gonna show you guys a few recommendations of some cheaper shoes that you can get. Some really good options are all white Converse, all white Vans, high top or low top. Um, all white Reeboks, classic leathers are sick. All white Adidas, originals, classic leathers are sick. Also, apologies if my lighting gets kind of wonky. It's a weird day outside. But okay, you guys, you guys know me with my all black shoes. You know what I'm about to pull out, right? My OG classics, the triple black Janoskis, these things have actually been worn on my feet since eighth grade. Not this exact pair, but these shoes, triple black Janoskis, eighth grade till now. I'm about to be a senior in college. This, this specific shoe has stayed in style for me for nine years. Now, that's not my only pair of all black shoes though. Recently, I finally got a different all black shoe and I actually love these. These things are so dope. These are Air Max 270s, one of my favorite shoes right now. Also have these ex this exact pair, but with the salmon like camouflage background. I'll try and pull up a picture right now. Um, love those too for like a tiny pop of color. Uh, but I don't want to get too crazy with it. I just wore these to Cedar Point the whole day, comfy as hell, but I don't really want them in any other color. I would really only do them in like all black or like the all black with a little bit. As I mentioned before, all white. I mean, they're not actually all white because they're Converse. So they've got the like red, white, and blue thing going on. I love straight up Converse. The bad thing about these is I'm not a huge fan of how these look if you're not wearing jeans. So like right now it's summer. I don't get a ton of use out of these because I think it looks stupid when I wear shorts and then these, which is why I am seriously running out of daylight here, so I do apologize, but that is why I have these. These are actually in the Kicks Shopping vlog, which I just posted. That's what I got these for. These Vapormax Flynets are so comfy and they look super good with like low cut socks and shorts. So that's what these are for. I don't recommend this purchase though because these boys are expensive. So unless you have like solid disposable income, this is probably not the move. All right, that's it for the basics. Now we're gonna move into the curveballs. You ready for this one? You ready for this curveball? This is, I am in my shoe shop. What is this? My sneaker, updated sneaker collection. I bring you a dress shoe. This style of dress shoe, you guys may think I'm the dumbest and this looks so stupid, but I promise you in, I would say six months, this will be the style of dress shoe. Right now, it's the wingtip, which is like the little narrow whatever. This is called monk strap. These things are fire. If you're trying to impress your lady friend and you're going to prom or you're going to something really nice, hey, don't take it from me, boys. You'll see one day. All right, now we get into the part where I have style advice and I have two of my favorite pairs of shoes right now. Okay, here's the thing. You have two options when it comes to shoes. Do I turn on the lights behind me? Is it literally that? Lighting YouTube videos is not fun. I'm so serious. You have two options when it comes to your outfit. Your shirt makes the outfit or your shoes make the outfit not, not full. full. Times I see someone wearing a champion big ass graphic t-shirt with champion graphic ass shorts, a champion fanny pack and champion shoes and champion socks. I like want to puke in my mouth. Now this is totally my personal opinion. If you wear that and you love it, that's what's important. Cause the most important thing about fashion is the confidence that you have when you leave your house. You wanna look good cause you wanna look good. So when you're walking around, you feel good. So if you wanna wear that, go ahead, my friend. But in my personal style opinion, no. Now also, as you guys know, I've been doing this channel for like four years now. You guys always ask about my clothes back in high school. I would always get a question about where I got a sweatshirt, where I got a hoodie. Well. I have an awesome surprise for you. Now that surprise is that today's video is sponsored by Poshmark. Poshmark is basically an app where you can just clean out your closet. It's awesome. You can get really nice stuff like Nike, Adidas, and even designer brands for like 70% off. Well, I have a ton of stuff that you guys have always asked about, 
that I've completely grown out of. To show you a few things in my closet right now, for one is this blue uh, Nike golf polo. Got this for my dad, it did not fit him, and I never got around to returning it, so. It's now up for grabs. Two, I have this, okay, I don't I don't know soccer. Someone gave this to me as a gift. It's Nike, it's super nice. I'm just not a big fan. The primitive hoodie. You guys know I'm sad to see it go, but I just can't do the color yellow. And this last one, I thought this would be awesome because you can't buy the maroon MMG OG merch anymore, but I have extras, like personally. So I thought I'd throw one of these up. I thought that'd be awesome. So if you're interested. I'll also let you guys see all the other stuff that I put in my closet. I haven't exactly decided yet, but you'll definitely see it on your screen right now. For the most part, it's gonna be all the Nike stuff under retail that I grew out of. So if you click the link in the description, that's gonna take you to Poshmark. From there, you can see my closet, which is at Matthew Maher, same as my Instagram. I'm gonna keep updating this thing as I'm cleaning out my closet and stuff. But yeah, again, guys, make sure you click that link in the top of the description to start your own closet on Poshmark. And I hope you enjoy the rest of the video. That brings me to one of my favorite shoes right now. I literally don't know what this shoe is called. I saw it on Nike.com and it's so awesome. It's an, it's a Nike Air of some sort because it's got the bubble, but they have so much pop. That's so cool. But if I'm gonna if I'm gonna wear this shoe out, right? If I'm gonna wear this shoe anywhere, I can't wear like a matching t-shirt to this. You cannot wear any of the colors on this shoe other than white or black if you are wearing the shoe out. Nice jeans that you cuff at the bottom, this shoe and a plain white t-shirt or a plain black t-shirt, maybe with something here. Like you can't be a popsicle. I see so many people get a shoe like this and then they wanna like, oh dude, I need coral pink on my shirt. Like I need a coral pink shirt to match with this. Like, please don't, please don't. That felt like a rant, it's not. I just want you guys to look good for the ladies. I'm trying to help you out. This shoe, also a super recent purchase of mine. I would wear it very similarly to these, except these you wear more like Converse's and these you wear like Air Max's. So this I would wear with light jeans. I would wear a white t-shirt, light, like light wash jeans, maybe with rips in them, and then these. This I could wear with like low cut black socks, black shorts, and a black t-shirt, or I could wear darker color jeans cuffed with these and long black socks and like a black t-shirt. Both of these are awesome shoes though. I love these. I have, I, have, I have two pairs left. I know I'm gonna get roasted for this pair, but custom Converse. I put all white everything, pink interior, which is like got my sock residue on it. That's not cool. I gave it the black and white logo. And then you could choose the patch and the patch color. And I chose this little pink rose. I just think it's so cool. I don't get a lot of use out of these. I just thought I'd show you guys them because they're custom and they're pretty cool. All right, and finally the last shoe. I know, like I said, guys, I really I really cleaned out my shoe closet and I don't have like crazy Jordans anymore. I do have more shoes than this. They're just uh, back home, but I didn't think they were important enough to even bring. This is my all time favorite shoe. These are my babies. I love these so much. Now, I would never, ever, 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 ever recommend you guys ever purchase a shoe like this. I am embarrassed at how expensive these things are. They're like Gucci slippers, I guess you could call it. They call it like a moccasin, but it's the most giant massive flex in the whole universe. So get flexed on. All right, boys, recap of what we learned. If you're gonna wear crazy, awesome, cool shoes, your favorite pair with lots of colors on it, try and keep the rest of your outfit downtoned. Always have a pair of black shoes and always have a pair of white shoes. And then my third thing I would say is you don't gotta have a crazy ass outfit every day. You can have a clean outfit every single day for cheap. You know, you could do like this. This t-shirt's like $10, I think. This decent pair of jeans and white Converse or white shoes, that's a great looking outfit. I would feel great going out in that. And you can do that for four or five days a week. And then on that one day a week when you're really trying to kill it, you, you got something important at school, you got an event to go to, you got something you really wanna do, that's when you bring out your good outfit. I know this is kind of a random video, but I like talking about this stuff and I'm not posting Madden, so I thought you guys would enjoy it. Hope you enjoyed, guys. That's all for now. Make sure you click that link in the top of the description to start your own closet on Poshmark. Thanks for watching as always, and I'll see you guys later. Peace out.